Hello everyone, welcome back to the Football Project YouTube channel. Today we're back with another video and is the reaction to the Champions League round of 16 draw. The games are Dortmund against PSG, Real Madrid against Manchester City, Atalanta against Valencia, Atletico Madrid against Liverpool, Chelsea against Bayern, Lyon against Juventus, Tottenham against Leipzig and Napoli against Barcelona. There are some very nice games in there, especially Dortmund against PSG will be a very good game. Real Madrid against Manchester City as well, and Chelsea Bayern and Napoli Barca. Uh, so I'm going to go with some predictions for each game. Uh, first of all, on Dortmund against PSG, I think PSG will cruise through Dortmund. I don't think they're going to have many troubles. Uh, and Bappe and Neymar are on another level this year again, and Dortmund are just I don't think they have enough to beat PSG over two legs. They might get something at home, but especially in Paris, I don't think they'll have any chance. And PSG for me have a very good chance this year of winning the whole thing, if Neymar and Mbappe stay healthy for the whole season. Now the next game is Real Madrid against Manchester City. Obviously the favorite is Manchester City. But it's against a very good European side and Manchester City are not that. Uh, they don't have the European pedigree that Real Madrid have. Even though Real Madrid don't have the best team right now they've had in the last few years. And Manchester City as well has not started as well this season. But by the time this game uh, happens, Laporte will probably be back in the lineup from his injury. So you're probably looking at a city, city going through, but I'm gonna go for a shock and go for Real Madrid most, mostly because I don't want City advancing to the round of uh, the next round. Now the next game is Atalanta against Valencia, probably the worst game of the draw. I'm gonna go with Valencia. Atalanta don't don't have the pedigree that Valencia have in Europe. It's the first time I think they'll be in the round of 16 and I think Valencia will go through. But it's not going to be easy, it's going to be a low score, it's going to be a very close game. Uh, now, Atletico Madrid against Liverpool. This is going to be a very tough game for Liverpool, but they will probably go through because Atletico, it's probably the worst side over the last five, six years. And uh, Simeone is uh, in trouble as well. He might get sacked. I don't think he will, but there's been reports that he's he's getting close to being sacked by Atletico. But uh, I don't think they have enough to get over Liverpool, unfortunately. Now the next game, Chelsea against Bayern. I think it's just it's going to be an easy Bayern win. They have too much firepower, and Chelsea's defense is n not that good. And Lewandowski, Gnabry are going to tear them apart, especially in Munich. Uh, Lyon against Juventus, again, it's going to be an easy easy game for Juventus. Memphis Depay got injured yesterday in the game. He's going to be out for six months, unfortunately. So that's basically their best player gone. So Juventus are going to cruise past them. Now... Spurs against Leipzig, another very difficult game to call. I'm going to go for a shock again here. I'm going to go for Leipzig. They've been very good this year. Uh, they've been good in the Champions League. and They have Timo Werner up front, who's a very good player. And he can cause the Spurs defence a lot of trouble. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a very difficult game to call this, but I'm going to go for a shock RB Leipzig win. And them going through to the quarterfinals. And last but not least, Napoli against Barcelona. A very big game, the Diego Maradona derby, if you want to call it that. Uh, Napoli have a very good squ squad this year, but they've not been performing at a high level. They've sacked uh, their manager uh, about a week ago. And uh, Barcelona just have Messi, so... Barcelona will be going through in this game. 
let me know what your predictions are in the comments below and I'm going to be back in a bit with the Europa League draw as well. See you then. Goodbye.